Hello and welcome back to another video of Trails of Cold Steel 2. Lion of Hyrule speaking. Last time we got through the prologue of the game and now we are about to start the first chapter. So this is where the battle or the game actually begins. All that stuff was not fun. Well, it was fun, but not fun. So it's December 1st, and we're parting. The scars left on Ymir were Ymir, fortunately much more shallow than Ymir. anyone had anticipated. Partly thanks to the fact that the number of assailants was relatively small, there were no fatalities. Well, that's good. And the next morning, everyone worked together to clean up the damages and restore the village to its original form. As best they could. That was Rain talking. You can still see the remnants of the damage it was done. And there's the Baron's house. However, my father was heavily wounded, and he had been in a deep sleep ever since. And while we knew his injuries weren't life-threatening, he would still need to be under careful watch for some time. Meanwhile, You're set on leaving now, aren't you? I am. I have to. I realize that with Dad unconscious, I should probably stay and protect Ymir in his place. Maybe you could even say that I've got a duty to do so as his son. Or as a Schwarzer. But I've got something else that I need to do. And to me, that takes priority. If that's your decision, Reen, then I've no intention of stopping you. Like I said, when you and Elise first left here to attend Thor's and St. Astraea, it's a mother's duty to watch over her children and wish them well as they fly the nest. Mom. <laughs> I'll be sure to watch over your father and this village in your absence. That's a lot to watch over. Do all that you can to bring Princess Alfin and Elise back safely. Oh yeah, we also got them captured by, by the freaky cat-haired, black-haired cat lady. Will do. Toval, Celine, please take care of him. You could count on me. On my honor as a member of the Bracer Guild, I'll do everything in my power to see your request through. I'd tag along even if he said no. Nah. It's about time we went and looked for Emma. Yeah, I agree. Thanks, you two. I'll be counting on you. Okay, Mom. We'll see you soon. Take care. And may the goddess watch over you. Righto. Your mom's a strong woman, all right. She really is. And I'll have to do everything I can to bring Elise and Princess Alfin back safely so that I don't let her down. No, I will bring them back. <laughs> Guess we can skip the pep talk if you're that fired up, huh? Make Guess sure to so. try and repay all that support she's given you the next time you swing by here. Speaking of next time, it's time to go. We're stopping by the valley before leaving, aren't we? Yeah. I want to see how Valimar's doing. Once we're ready, let's head out. Quick travel. Here I go! Oh. That's how it is. Okay. Oh. I thought that was the valley. Wrong one. That's the chapel. The heck is it? <clears throat> right. 
Right. Just trying to get my bearings. Trying to remember where I am. As far as I mentioned. Picnic table. There we go. Uh, all right, upgrading slots. Synthesizing quartz, huh? Nice. Just about to head off. Now we're going to talk to Camilla real fast and continue our journey. Trading, huh? to walking on the snow. The Divine Knight's exactly how you left him, too. Thankfully. It wouldn't have surprised me if Vita had tried messing with him, but he looks just fine. Yeah, looks couldn't be deceiving, though. Speaking of, do you have any idea what she might be after? She knows Valimar is here, but as far as I can tell, she's not interested in stealing or destroying him. For now, anyway. It's kind of weird when you think about it. He's probably one of the biggest threats to the Noble Alliance. I've got no idea what goes on in that head of hers. Nah, <laughs> nor do most people. But I'd say that there's a good chance her and the Noble Alliance's goals aren't as perfectly aligned as you might think. That's always a problem. And if that's true, whatever she's doing is probably for the benefit of Ouroboros. Hmm. You said the Anguis are the top brass in the society, right Toval? If she's that high up, I wouldn't be surprised if that is the case. Well, whatever she wants. Can't see it being good news for us. Never is. They've been trouble all over the continent in the past. I dread to think what they've got in store here in Erebonia. 
Same here. But, well, at least we've got time to stop them. Things could have ended a lot worse yesterday if not for Valimar's help. Amen. I can't even imagine the ways Ymir would have suffered if we didn't stop that magic knight. I'll need yeah. to thank him when he wakes up. That will not be necessary. What? Whoa! Didn't see that coming. Valimar? I suppose one night was enough for you to recover a little bit of your mana. Not enough to freely move around though, I'm guessing. Correct. Further rest will be required in order to return to full capacity. Okay, get as much rest as you need. We'll call on you if anything else happens, okay? Acknowledged. Wow, easy enough to communicate with him, huh? Then again, I think that one Gordius class robot could technically talk too. Is something wrong? Oh, no, just thinking. I sense a change has occurred in your group since I last entered a state of inactivity. Confirming the absence of the weight floor of one number. Assuming that some form of irregularity has occurred. Well, you'd be right. Technically, what that means in layman's terms is one of the characters left. Wait, is he talking about Elise? Maybe. He appears to be aware of what's going on around him to an extent. Valimar, we're going to be leaving this region for a while. My sister and the princess <clears throat> have been taken away, and we're going to rescue them. Plus, I need to find and reunite with my classmates, too. So take this chance to recover as long as you need, okay? Classmates, I assume that this word refers to those who have aided you in overcoming the trial to become an awakener. You would be correct, Valimar. Yeah, is that a big deal or something? Valimar? Confirming waveform locations. But he knows where they are? Excluding the Awakener of Azure, the Remain Procure be located in three different regions. All vital signs are normal. Well, that's good to hear. Hold up a sec. Does that mean you know where all of them are? I see now. Do you remember when you overcame the trial to become Valimar's Awakener? Well, obviously, you weren't alone when you did that. You were with the rest of Class 7. And it sounds like, thanks to them being there with you, they've all been recognized as secondary contractors at the same time. Oh, that's exciting. Oh! So that's how... Please, Valimar, tell me where they all are! Detecting approximate locations using geographical database. Three are to the southeast in the Keldic region. Okay. Three are to the northeast in the north region. six. Three are to the south-southeast and the Nine. This includes a list of locations of all nine secondary contractors. All vital signs appear normal. Yep, that's all of them. That confirms my theory. They're all okay. They're really okay. <laughs> that's exciting. I'm really happy for you. Though I sure wasn't expecting us to get confirmation of their safety quite like this. Ugh, <sighs> look at you crying away. And you call yourself a man. Hey, cut it out. Big man cry too. Quiet you. Yeah, quiet you. Aw, oh, come on. You can't pretend you aren't breathing a sigh of relief right along with us. This means Emma's safe too, you know. <laughs> I think Ugh. that cat is I, for offended. One, definitely breathing a sigh of relief. Still, all three locations are a ways away from Ymir. Yep. Yeah. I'm pretty sure the Noble Alliance has got control of key locations all over the country on top of it all. Pretty sure they do. On the plus side, they're all on the eastern side of the Empire. But getting to them ain't exactly going to be a walk in Mater Park. Oh, hey, wait! Valimar, can't you use the spirit path? Affirmative. Doing so would consume all of my current mom, however. Spirit path? The heck? What's that? It's the name given to a really old means of travel. Well, obviously. Using it will allow us to travel instantly to even distant locations. Seriously? That's awesome! How? 
You know how there are still remnants of animism all across Erebonia, right? Um, what's animism? Well, places like that are connected to one another by spirit veins. Septium veins, in other words. And Valimar has the ability to use those veins to travel. Like, blood through your body? Yeah, that's kind of going over my head. But basically, you're saying it's like an invisible road that connects places like Legram to here or wherever else? Exactly. The spirit path can only be used between areas where animism had a hold, though. Right. The other drawback is that taking it will use up what little mana Valimar's been able to recover. Which means that until he's recovered enough to travel again, we won't be able to come back here. I see. Well, Personally, I can't think off. of any better options. I think we should give it a try. What do you think? It sounds worth a shot to me. Now all that's left is to pick which place we should head to first. Right. Keldic, the Nord Highlands, or Legram. Uh, I think Keldic is the closest to here. Maybe we should try heading there first? Keldic, huh? I'm down. Should make a good test run for this whole spirit path deal. All decided? Come with me then. I guess we're decided. I have no choice in the matter but to go to Keldic. Right. The monument would have ties to animism. Hmm, this seems like a good enough spot. Are you both ready? Ready. Anytime. Velimar, open the spirit path. Our destination is Keldic. I'll lend you all the support I can, too. Acknowledged. Here we go off to Keldic to re to retrieve some of our lost compatriots. Whoa, hey, the ground's glowing. No, I thought it was moving. What's this? All right, here we go. They're going to make us apparate. Ooh, shiny. This is the spirit path? It's like nothing I've ever felt. It's both cool and warm at the same time. And at the end of this path, some of my classmates are waiting for me. Which ones, I don't know. single one of them. I'll bring us all back together, no matter what it takes. We're gonna go find our classmates. All right, let's keep going. Yay, we need to find the park. Um...
All right. Well, this looks like a good place to stop. Um, Valimar is in Odin's sleep for three days. Use the rest of his uh, power to get us here through the trail. And we are going to continue to find our uh, classmates in this uh, nature park. And so that is where we will pick up next time. Uh, we play Trails of Cold Steel 2. This has been Lion of Hyrule. And I am signing up.